Hello fellow weirdos. Once again, welcome to peek over my shoulder as I try to make my way in Westland 2. Today, I'm basically bracing for all the loss and shame and and all that comes with the with accepting the outcome that I don't want to accept. But all in good time. First, we need to install that repeater again. You will notice that I have left behind my super pumped brawler crew and uh, taken Rolfi back into the squad and also we're bringing the crazy guy with us just because mostly because I want to hear the NPC's comment on shit Okay, who has the repeater? Yes, you do. Oh well. <laughs> All right, Echo One, do what you need to do, but get back here as soon as you're done. Don't stop to smell the flowers. You read me? Roger, Echo One. See you soon. Ring the command out. So, did you attach your hitch to your bosun or whatever it was, and everything was hunky dory? Fine, fine. Hey, glad it all worked out. Oh, fuck off. Fuck on, brothers and sisters. How funny. I've never heard anyone talk like that before. All right, so here's the situation. Uh, for over a year, I think, in real time. I have tried to make a third option work at the prison camp and I've tried to brute force my way past those turrets but even though I thought there was hope 
like I noticed that my guys were able to survive past one hit we still wouldn't last a whole round so so that's kind of shit yeah go on and like I think if you if you built your characters with that thing in mind from the very start maybe it would work but right now uh, yeah fuck off we have we've been grinding on all these robots so we can skip a few encounters so yeah I think I think that it might be theoretically possible to break through there uh, if you built your character to be super strong but not with this squad Let's save the game here. Right, we don't we don't really need to stop anywhere. I know everybody's dead. All the civilians around the area are dead. So let's, let's skip straight to the prison itself. Not gonna stop to examine the bodies either. Just, I just wanna move on. Somehow my attempts got the worse, uh, got like worse and worse the more I tried. But at first it seemed that we were able to locate a blind spot where the second turret couldn't see us. But I think that was just wishful thinking. Okay, let's talk to this idiot. Uh, 
Yeah, you idiot. Give it to me, you ass. we now all right let's carry on with this now as we climb up to the gates uh, here's my take on the on design choices here like I feel that there's a whole missed opportunity Okay, I, I get that uh, the story is supposed to be bleak and everything, but I think that if the player is able to figure out the whole Bobby and Rex uh, connection before, as we did, I mean we we have bones and and Bobby guns in our inventory and everything. Like I don't know how it how it would work mechanically, but it would be really neat if the player had the option to inquire uh, about uh, Rex and Red Rider and all that before uh, before the dogs even get sick. walk right in and fuck you and fuck you and fuck you and fuck you you're cool but not all the way so we're going in I even tried uh, to shoot rockets across the fence but uh, these guys are too far so I wasn't able to trigger anything A missed opportunity if you ask Vargas about uh, Bobby and Rex beforehand I mean like before the situation unfolds y you get nothing well let me tell you a little story once upon a time a boy and his dog lived in high pool and one day the rangers came to town and killed the dog oh they said it had rabies but does that explain them gunning down the little boy too when he was armed with nothing but a BB gun any wonder that when that little boy clawed his way back from the edge of the grave, he vowed to hurt the desert rangers worse than they'd hurt him? Any wonder that he started the biggest, baddest gang in the land and made the desert rangers their public enemy number one? We're a militia now, Ranger. 
confront him about his bobbiness because I'm not sure if I will be able to ask everything otherwise. Well, that only took 15 fucking years. Give the ranger a cigar. Now, see if you can guess the size of the hole I'm gonna put in your head. Ha, that's rich. You need <laughs> to take advice from the desert rangers? Why would I want to do that? Yeah, so this is where I'm gonna do a 180 because everybody stayed anyway. Uh, there's literally nothing to gain by killing him, so I'm gonna try to broker something with him. Do a save here. Now, wait, 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 don't, 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 don't. Where, why did I click somewhere else? I don't know. Okay, so... Yo! Raina! She's better already! Amazing! Now, go to the kennel. Rangers, hurry! Don't you ranger me! Raina, who's a good girl? Who's a good girl? I think those are the kennels over there? Yes, Wait. sir. <laughs> okay, so okay. Dogs, 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 dogs. Look at all the doggies. Hello, doggies. him about Rex. Oh, okay. <laughs> Some characters say, I don't know, uh, more eloquently than others.
do a little quick save in the meantime. Wait, is that all of the dogs? I'm not sure. But let's talk with this guy. <laughs> Looks like he's been here for a long time. Okay, um, we might need to come back to him. Okay, any, any more dogs? Let's see, oh, I can't zoom in on the map. Yeah, you guys keep watch over here. Uh, okay, I can't go there. Can I go up here without causing anything? Yo. I have so many levels that you people just can't do shit. Okay, let's get everybody gathered around. Any more dogs? Bring us all the dogs. don't exactly remember what happens in Wasteland 1, but I'm pretty sure the rangers didn't uh, actually shoot Bobby. I, I don't remember the specifics. Okay, quick save here. Where's the big boss? Out here. some dogs or maybe I need to do something with the game as well oh there's one more wasn't there like a Oh, okay, so there was this one more. Uh, dude! Yeah, I think it's it's tricky on purpose, like, because the dogs are this earthen brown. 
and the earth is dark brown and all that, okay. Did you cure my dogs from the kennel? Is that so? Gamble. Sir. Yes, sir. Okay, dokie. Alright then, we're done here. Run on back to old Snakey and let him know I'm willing to talk. I ain't promised nothing, but we'll talk. Okie dokie. Um I am going to end this episode here and start a new one once we're either in the citadel or or if maybe we run into something odd on our way so thank you very much for watching i will see you in the next one bye